Greetings, fellow outsiders, and welcome to a game called Bem Feito. If you're wondering, that actually means well done in Portuguese. Please correct my pronunciation in the comments if you know better than I do. But this game is a life sim where players follow Reginaldo, a charming and almost silent protagonist. Reginaldo's simple life revolves around his daily household tasks, captivating friends, and perhaps unexpected choices that subtly shape the course of the game. To me, this game definitely feels like a hidden gem, so I can't wait to jump into it. Let's log in. Woo! Please wait a few secs, rendering desktop. Welcome to... <laughs> I keep thinking that says Gagatron, but it doesn't. It says Garotron OS. Uh, trademarked. Welcome to the Garotron OS, the advanced operating system made for the best emulation experience of Jogaroto. Navigate through the menu and desktop items with the WASD keys. Confirm your decisions with the space key or the enter key. Cancel or return with the X key. You can also delete files at your will with the Z key or the delete key. Interesting. For better user's accessibility, it is possible to achieve the zooming magnifier with the shift key, and the user can move the zooming magnifier using the arrow keys. For further ref uh, info, refer to the manual. Uh, to start Benfeto's game emulation, select the Garotrons app on your desktop. Have a great time. I have read and agree to proceed. I think so. All right, let's do it. Oh, this is cool. I love the little mouse, how it grabs the different applications. So we have the manual. Scan Benfeto manual .ml, uh, MNL. Table of contents, how to start the game, safety instructions or concerns. Introduction, how to play game controls, Megasoft uh, um, Amigo. <laughs> That's cute. So it's like Ami, but go. Um, how to connect. Okay. I can print this. I don't know that I need to. How to start the game. Insert your Benfeto cartridge. Pick two upside down in the lower uh, cavity of the Megasoft Jogaroto handheld console. The cartridge should be in the exact position as seen in the picture. Got it. Be the process. Followed correctly, the game should start automatically. The Megasoft Jorato does not require the usage of batteries nor a power button. Drink plenty of water and feed well. Avoid playing for too many hours straight. Pay attention. Megasoft would not be held responsible for any occasional brain injuries caused for long exposure to the hardware. Safety concerns. Strictly not recommended for the usage of console underwater or at temperatures superior of 5,000 degrees Celsius or 932 degrees Fahrenheit. Well, we got a wide range here. We can play this almost everywhere except underwater and on the sun. Absolutely avoid playing the game while sleeping or amidst high altitude climbs. It is highly forbidden to swallow and ingest any of the hardware parts. Offenders will be subject to legal action? All right, some of these instructions are kind of weird. Introduction. Bem Feto is an exciting adventure game where you take control of a little friend, Rinaldo. Rin Reginaldo, and meet his companions, Gertrude's Jubilee, Car Carlitas, Clarice, and the cat. And that's in pick seven. All these characters are really cute. Uh, Reginaldo lives on a tiny cozy planet called B613, and he is hoping to increase his list of friends with your help. How to play. Reginaldo needs to help complete his daily tasks. Help Reginaldo complete house chores so he can kick back and take a nap on his comfy little bed. And we have some game controls. Arrow keys. Use the arrow keys to move Reginaldo and to switch between the menu options. Use Mega S button and empty your hands while holding something. Use the Mega X button mm, to cancel options or exit menus. Got it? Soft buttons. Use the soft space button to interact with Reginaldo's world and confirm actions. Use the soft P button to cause, uh, pause the game. So I think this just goes with more controls that we need to know. Megasoft Amigo. How to connect. Uh, it is a wonderful surprise that Megasoft has prepared just for you. Uh, get now your new best amigo, Reginaldo. He will play with you even beyond the game? What do you mean? Is this, like, concerning? Should I be concerned? Should I be scared of you, Reginaldo? Megasoft Amigo operates through the innovative near-field communication NFC technology. All you need to do is place it near the console, and yay, you will unlock new features and unique interactions in your game. This technology is unique and groundbreaking, even the international, even in the international game market. If you already own a Megasoft Amigo, just put it close to your Megasoft Gerato while playing Bem Feto. Order now with a number and get your new Amigo. Call subject to high sky fees and immeasurable charges. Immeasurable charges? Should I print this? 
error. There's no connected printer. Refer to the manual for more info. Okay, so we've got this. Um, how do I go back to the manual though? Like exit out of here. Oh, X, there we go. Um, Jaga, or Jar, <laughs> Jarotron OS manual. Let's look at this one next. Megasoft Jar uh, Jarotron user guide. Getting started on Jarotron OS. Desktop navigation tips, FNQ, and precautions. I feel like this just gets us set up. This gets us set up before we have some fun with our uh, Jarotron. Getting started on the Jarotron OS. You are getting started on the OS, the advanced operating system. For the best, Joga Roto emulating experience. Following this user guide, the user will find substantial info about the system to enjoy the authentic Megasoft experience. Desktop. The Garatron OS, to enhance our user experience, offers a visual hub for the main apps on the desktop. Let's go to a desktop tour, shall we? Documents folder holds system relevant protected files. We are currently oblivious to the exact weight this file has on the system, but we could not let uh, leave them out of the advanced operating system by any means, despite our efforts. ROMs folder holds the 99 classic Megasoft game, Bemfeto, ROM for emulation. For safety concerns, this folder is also protected. What? Also, they have little, uh, asterisks, so I imagine we're gonna read about this later. To get the ROM running, we suggest you, uh, the user search for Jarotron app on the desktop. Manual folder holds important tools for user information and enlightenment. Here, the user will discover the best way to enjoy Megasoft's products. For safety concerns, this folder is also protected. All of them are protected. Hey. Okay, we've got our first glitch here. Jarotron app is carefully developed with the perfect, complete, and faithful emulation experience for Jogaroto in mind. To get started, to start the emulator, the user just needs to run the following prompt command, exec rom underscore have a great time. Okay, do I need to remember that? Exec rom. Okay. Mail inbox app is the safest and fastest MegaNet dialer ever made. The user should feel at home accessing the MegaNet and browsing through their electronic mail anytime should the user please to. It is free of charge. Profile app was specifically customized for you, user. This should have loads of fun with the newly crafted achievement system for an up-to-date, unprecedented experience of the game Benfeto. Uh, Recycle Bin app is currently doing something. And then finally, for the user's interest, settings app serves as a tool to adjust the sound, volume, and language to the user's taste for Garatron OS to set up the Benfeto's configuration and the game in the settings menu. Okay. Navigation tips. Use the AWST um, to navigate through the system's icons. Space key to enter. Yeah, this is just stuff. Press Z to delete any files at will. And then there's something glitching there. It doesn't want us to delete files, I guess, potentially. <laughs> so we should. There's also the zooming magnifier for the user's accessibility options, pressing the shift key and the user can move. Some files in the folders are protected by the system. The protected folders indicated by brackets and must not be modified nor deleted by the user. We wholeheartedly thank the user's comprehension and respect. Meganet is Megasoft's internet dialer service. We brought back for our users this amazing and avant-garde internet service. FNQ precautions. The user may pay attention to the following warnings. Error 01. For the user's own safety, they cannot be given access to the desktop before consenting to our end user license agreement. The user may not erase this particular file for 101. This file is essential to the system and the user's very comfort and safety. Please do not insist. So maybe we explore a little bit and then we just start deleting files on the computer. That's the vibe that I'm getting from this. Error 366, the Garatron OS version is not equipped for the execution of this particular file format. Beware. Okay, error 613, uh, what the user is trying to do is not currently possible on the Garatron OS. The user may never try it again. Error 9x9, nine nine, system warning. In case user erases a file, it may hinder, hinders impossible to run it. FNQ precautions, and then we have 596. The Garatron OS is currently not equipped to print without a printer. The user may wait for new future patches to correct this little oversight of the system. So I might be able to print things later. And then error 910, it is not possible to run files that do not exist. Okay, all right. So we finished that manual. We have credits and special thanks. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, let's take a look at the credits really quick. Is there gonna be any Easter eggs? No? 
At the very least, we get to say thank you very much for making a wonderful game. Wonderful so far, at least. To all of you who support this journey, special thanks. Oh, cool. Okay. I like it when games find special or creative ways to add in credits or special things, especially. I think it's very cool. Um, okay, we'll close out of this and then go into ROMs. Then Fato. What is this? Uh, I keep clicking the wrong buttons. I'm sorry. Air 366 file format not supported. Um, so we can't open Ben Fato right now for the ROMs and then documents. Oh, we've got a ton of stuff. All of this is encrypted though. Please put in the password. So we don't know the password yet, but maybe we'll find it later. Then we have our profile locked. Shh, it's a secret. I need my basket to pick up apples. Find all the little secrets of Ben Fato and the great classic. Oh, this is, um, is this achievements? Uh, this might be achievements for our profile. I think that's what it said in the profile to mail inbox. Whoa. <laughs> We're dialing up to the internet. For you, dearest, forward, forward, hi, KB, ever heard of Ben Fato? Uh, Cabby here. Hi! <laughs> We're also happy to finally show you the newest version of Goratron. I mean, we came up with a whole new OS to bring it onto modern platforms, and that was a lot of work. Oh, phew! Unfortunately, we are yet to access some of the files that Fabi has sent to us, for they are heavily encrypted, and we need a password to open. If you find out any of them passwords, please tell us with the hashtag, hashtag Benfeto, uh, Joe Guino? On our socials, so we can help figure things out. Lots of love, and have fun! Thank you very much. So is that that's is that our friend or that seemed more like a set email from like a company? Fabi Mesquita? Uh, hi KB, ever heard of Ben Feto? Hi, my name is Fabiola. I'm 13 years old, or I would be if we were in 1999. <laughs> Serious. Uh, that same year, Ben Feto was released, a game developed by Megasoft for their new console, Jogoroto. Recently, while messing around with some old hard drives, I found a folder with a ROM of the game for which I have no idea to how it got there, and then did some web sleuthing, hoping I could find any emulator that could run that thing. First, I did a normal search and couldn't find anything. Then I looked up in some gaming online boards, specialized sites, and even some retro gaming servers. Nothing. Not only did I find no emulator for the console, also there was no digital version of the game either. I found it quite odd given that people nowadays are so obsessed with retro games or anything in the nostalgia trend. Something told me to start searching about the company and the console, and then things started getting a little weirder. There was nothing. Nada. Not even a post. Not even a fan art. Nothing. I talked to some friends to see if anyone else remembered or maybe still had the console, but no one did. Felt like I was the only one who knew about the game. Even for me, any childhood memory about it is very vague. To be honest, a friend of mine vaguely remembered the game and mentioned that their cousin had in fact talked about it and even showed them the console. When I asked for a way to contact the cousin, my friend informed me that they had sadly passed away. As weird as it is, no one seemed to know anything about the game. So I left that aside and ended up dismissing the issue. A few weeks later, I went to my local library to research some newspapers for my underground thesis. I'm majoring in Portuguese. While digging through the piles of dusty old newspapers, I ended up finding something that caught my attention. A small report on the launch of the Joga Roto. I was so thrilled to find something that could confirm my memory, even though I was so little. After scanning the report, I attempted to find information about the journalist who wrote it when I got home. Unsurprisingly, I couldn't find anything. I think the name was probably just a pseudonym uh, someone used to write the story down. Anyway, the reason I'm mailing you all of this is because I saw one of your posts about being a game developer and decided to send you the ROM just in case you're interested in trying to emulate it. I think it would be cool to bring back this game to see if we can get any information about it or the company. Thanks for reading this, Winky Face. P.S. Attached to this, there is a folder with a ROM, a picture of what seems to be a Jogoroto and some other files that I couldn't open. Okay, so this is forwarded. But this was originally sent to, am I saying that right, KB? Kabi? Um, and then Kabi messaged it to us. And I don't know if we know who we canonically are in the game yet. But that's interesting, so nobody knew could remember this game. It's like a forgotten piece of media. Jagaratra, or this, and then our settings. Should I look at the settings? Sound masking? Misophonia? What is misophonia? That's interesting. Okay, um, screen foil? Ooh, oh, interesting. They have different things. You can do one bit CRT. We'll do no foil for right now. 
And then we have the recycle bin. Can I enter this? The folder is empty. Empty. I have a feeling if we try and delete this, it's gonna have something bad happen. Can I delete it? I can open it. X to close the emulation act. Return to desktop. Should we start it? Let's just start it. Wow! Bem Fato, new game. I don't have any other options. I can do settings. Wait, is it... Is it, like, lagging? I can open settings. Here we go. Okay, I can't access continue, but I can do a new game. Let's do a new game. Day one! Hi! <laughs> Chores, sweep the house, take out the trash, water the veggies, mow the lawn, and take a peek at the sewer, but it's freaking out. So we can move Reginaldo with this, interact, confirm, drop the tool, cancel back, and pause. Can I pause the game? I can. I can go to the title screen, settings, or quit. Unsaved data will be lost. Let's just play around with this game a little bit. We can always go back and do some different things. All right, let's sweep up. I like our little character though, Reginaldo. He looks so happy. Do, 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 do. Hey, we did it. Is he doing a little peace sign? We did it. Okay. And it's saving me. Can I put this back? Can I just pick this up next? Oh, I need to put it down with C. So drop this. Now my hands are free. Yes, they are, Reginaldo. Can I take the trash outside? This is gonna be our first time seeing outside. Let's go for a stroll. Play tutorial? Sure, yeah. This is my WC. Um, you're not making me go there, right? <laughs> I'd get a bit, bit embarrassed. This is my lawnmower. You know what to do with it, right? Here's my little pond. Let's try to reel in a big one someday. Hmm. This tree should be enough if I ever need firewood. From here, you can see my garden and my lawn. Such cuties. Uh, this is my toy box. This is where I keep all I need to do my chores. My well has dried out, but the bucket should be useful for other stuff. Hey, who left this basket out here? It seems to magically transport things to the kitchen pantry. Aww. My apple tree. Hope it gives fruit soon. Ouch, that's creepy. We don't need to go down there, right? I'm kind of lonely, so sometimes I write myself some letters. Hmm, is this garbage day? That's all. We covered everything. So fun, right? Fun, for sure. I Do I need to go back and pick up the trash again? Let me check the mail. I don't think I can. So we've got the trash over here. Cute little apple tree. Ooh, hey. Oh, am I gonna collect apples by going back and forth? I bet that's what it is. And my hands are free. Okay, I like this. The one thing I do know that I need to do is pick up the trash, so let's go back out. I'm not gonna go in the sewer quite yet, because we don't have to. I do wanna do that before the end of the day, so I hope it lets me. Let's take out the trash. Yay! <laughs> I like the little celebration. <laughs> and it's saving our game. Our game within a game. Do And we're back inside. I see a crack behind the thing as well. Water the veggies and mow the lawn. Should I mow the lawn first? I don't have the ingredients for my special recipe right now. That's not the time to play video games. Ooh. Uh, that says por favor. Okay, let's go out. So I have to mow the lawn and water the veggies. Is there a um, watering can somewhere around here? I see the sewer. Mow the lawn. We can try and make him go in the WC as well. Okay. The sound is a little creepy to me. Do I take this over here? Yeah. All right. Beautiful, we can see the night sky out into nothingness. I can see how good lonely out here though. Yeah! Can I put this down? 
It's saving me. Now my hands are free. Okay, so I can just put that down wherever. I think this is where I get the water. The bucket is stuck. I can't move it now. Why? Where are we going? The toy box? Why do I have an ax? You're scaring me, Reginaldo. There's a fishing, fishing place over here. Didn't he say this one tree would be good enough for firewood? No need for firewood today. Let's leave the tree alone. But we can pick up an ax. Let me put this back and we'll get some water. My hands are full and my hands are free. What else do we have in here? We have an ax. We have a hammer. We have a shovel. We have a watering pot, a fishing rod and the ax. I don't think I need any of that right now. Wait, watering pail? Is that what I just said? I thought it was hammer. Wait. Axe, hammer, shovel, watering pot. Yeah, of course I need that. <laughs> All right, let's get some water. The well is dry, frowny face. All right, then that means maybe here. Now the watering pot is full, smiley face. And we get to water our garden. Are you watering? I think you're watering, right? Here we go, baby. Anything else? Right here? Oh, does it have a little pepper? I think my hands are full, though. And there's nothing in the back. Wonder why I can't water the things in the back. Yay! We did it! <laughs> All right, and it's saving us. I'm gonna drop the watering can immediately. My hands are free and we'll pick up these guys. Can I not? Oh, I can't. Oh, I need the pail, don't I? Here we go, let's do it. Those are not ready to be harvested yet. They need to be ripe. Oh, okay, so maybe in a couple days, my hands are free. Okay, it did say, let me go back in one more time because I think I've done all of the tasks that I need for today, but it did say here, take a peek at the sewer. So it is the last thing that I need to do. Is it just shaking because he's scared? Is it shaking because he's scared or is there something to be scared of? Only one way to find out. Oh, well, I like the music. Ooh, why can I go in the sewer? <gasps> I found secrets. You become responsible forever. What'd you say? Why are you glitching? Stop. I didn't get to read everything that you said. I always have to check the walls for secrets and I guess it was worth it. You can also see it with the light there, I guess. Is that it? Wait, that's it for me? You become respo- <gasps> Stop it. You were smiling at me. Okay. Is that it for today? Day one? I finished all my chores for today. Time to take a nap. Let's do it. time proceed to the next day yep I'm all done for today or no I need a bit more time is there anything else I can look at you know what because it seems like this is a game that might have some secrets about them let's just do a lap because I also said that I would see what happens when we went to the toilet he doesn't want to go there is there going to be a invisible wall back here can we just go on forever I don't like that feeling I don't like that feeling at all. I'm going back. Okay, I feel satisfied with my exploration. I think we can take a nap now. Unless you wanna play video games? It's not the time. It's always the time to play video games. I'm all done for the day. For sure, Reginaldo. It's day two now. Check your profile. 
For what? Okay, he's looking at the thing. Pick some apples, harvest the veggies, water the flowers, read the letters, take Gertrude for a swim. And now that one's the one that's like freaking out. So Gertrude, we have to find. We also can like pause the game, right? Can I save the game? Title screen, unsaved data will be lost. Did it just save me? Well, let's just quit anyways. Because we can check our profile now. I think profile means that we get... Ah, ta-da, you've completed the chores. You can get go to bed now. So that one is unlocked. So I unlocked one of those. Did I get anything in my mailbox now? We have to dial up to it. I'm really curious about this game now. I'm also kind of... Because, like, I can pause it or I can put the text up on the screen for the sewer message before. Okay, so we've got nothing here. Um, but I'm so curious because I really want to know what it was. It went away before I could finish it. Also, can I just delete this? How do I delete things again? Let me look at the manual. It's not even giving me an option. Z? Oh, it's not... Okay, wait, maybe I'm reading it wrong. I thought maybe I could try and delete it. I hit Z, delete, backspace... When selecting the app, can I do it here? No, okay, let's continue. Let's continue, go into day two. We got one achievement. Maybe we'll get some emails today. Check your profile, you keep saying that. Is that just like at the start of the day? Okay, so we have to take Gertrude for a swim, I understand. Uh, I don't need to, I don't need to sweep. No, my hands are free. I need to go out and do all the stuff. Pick some apples, harvest the veggies, water the flowers, and read the letters. So everything is outside today. See, there's a crack in his thing behind the fridge. I wonder if that's going to be important. The doorbell? <gasps> Will I finally get some company? Hello? Hi! Hi! I'm Gertrude's. Pleased to meet you! Gertrude's! <gasps> I love her! Oh my god, she's so cute. Sorry to show up all of a sudden. But I love veggies! Ooh! -woo. <laughs> and I saw how well you care for the bell peppers. Congrats! To be honest, I wonder if I would love to help you take care of the garden, but I can't stay too close to the water. But we could go for a walk around your lawn, right? Uh, yes or no? Yeah, I like her. She's cute. Yay! <laughs> so we just have to take her around for a walk. Can I do things while she's with me? I can. We can just go for a walk. Can I go this way? Does she have anything to say? Okay, I do hit a wall. Because that stopped me there. So we're confined in this space. As it is. Where do I take you to? Just around? Do. Oh, she's fire. Well, why are we here? Don't tell me that evil little smile. I know I'm the one that clicked on it. <gasps> Stop it. I, I don't like water. Stop it. Stop this. Please? Did I have a choice not to do that? Oh my god! Reginaldo, you're a murderer! I wasn't causing him to advance, but I did click on the lake with her here. Could I have taken her down to the sewer, I guess? Oh my god, I feel awful. Check your profile, I guess, okay. It would be so nice if they stayed here with me forever. Is that what he's trying to do? Yay! All right, I have to harvest these vegetables. I think I have to pick up the thing. Don't I also have to water the plants? I hate that the mu well, I love that the music has changed. But it's very creepy. Okay, we're gonna pick up these apples. Three, four, five, six. Done! 
My apples are now in the kitchen. And I feel like I need a e more evil voice for him. Also, there were six apples. Can I drop this? No, actually, I don't want to drop it yet. I think I need to harvest the uh, plants over here. Is there something in the back there? Oh, no, that's just the uh, fence overlapping on itself. Nice. 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 Amazing. Done! My peppers are now in the kitchen. What voice should I give him? Done! My peppers. I feel like that one kind of fits since he's smiling all the time. My peppers are always in the kitchen. Uh, oh, these are the flowers that I need to water, right? Okay, I feel really bad. <laughs> now my hands are free. Yeah, but they're not clean. You see that blood in the water? That was you. That was you. I take no responsibility. It was not me. Yippee! Let's go fill it up. Wash, water our plants with the blood of our friends. Now the watering pot is full, smiley face. Now the watering pot is full. Yeah, I like that voice for him, I think. Beautiful! They're so pretty. And we get the immediate gratification of being able to see them grow right before our eyes. Yay! Do 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 do. Can I climb that ladder? Is that a ladder over there, by the way? And it's saving me. Finished all my chores for today. Time to take a nap. Now my hands are free. Okay, I don't think there's anywhere else I can go. No, I can go to the sewers. Yeah, can I climb up here? I can. Why? Is there a point? There must be a point later on. Let's go visit the sewer. He scared me by jumping towards me. Anything here today? No, just a lot of glitches. Yay, what a productive and horrifying day we've had today. How, huh, Reginaldo? What do you have to say? Are we gonna play video games today? I don't have the ingredients for my special recipe right now. I think we're ready. I think we're all done for today. We'll get through like another day before checking our profile unless there's something that would indicate that it's pressing for us to check. Check my profile. Yeah, I think it's probably just a day though. Do, do, do. Get some secret sauce trademarked and <laughs> go fishing. Cook, read letters, and make some special discs for Jubilee. Is that, am I saying that right? Jubilo? Jubilo. Jubilo. Maybe that's it. Uh, okay, secret sauce, fishing, cook, read letters. Where is the secret sauce? How do I get the secret sauce? But who am I cooking for? That's not the time to play video games. Can I go anywhere off screen here? Is there a secret door? Alright, it was worth checking. I think I'll need a bucket to get the secret sauce in the sewer. The doorbell? The secret sauce in the sewer? First of all, back up a second. Maybe another guest? Hey. Hey, who's this guy? Hi. <gasps> Jubilo is my name. Oh, he looks cool. What is he? Is he a mushroom? Oh, uh, I was brought here by the smell of flowers. After all, I'm a nose. Oh, he's a no. <laughs> You're a nose? And they smell so good. OMG. Hi. 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 <laughs> what a beautiful day. I like. I'm gonna give him a nasally voice. I just came to make a friend, unless you don't want to. I want to be friends, sure. I mean, who would want me? I want you as a friend, for sure. Reginaldo does not have a nose anyway, so... <laughs> Heart smiley face. Oh, but of course! I can see it in your eyes! Hmm? You want to be my pal? Yay! We'll have lots of fun together! <laughs> Whoa, slow down. <laughs> Actually, I'm kind of hungry right now. Do you 
Got any snacks? I do, sure. Yay! Let's go! What do I give him? I have to make him my secret sauce? Is that what it is? Oh my god, the secret sauce is the stuff in the sewer, though. Check the mail. Let's get some grub! Okay, I gotta do this first. I uh, said I needed a bucket. Oh, a bucket? This thing? Here we go. Let's go. Is the blood still here? The blood is still here. Let's go get some grub. All right, let's go. Can I not go down? Oh, do I have to go in the house? I thought I needed to get the secret sauce first or something. Hey there, buddy. Oh, you're just in my house now? <laughs> cool. I have to get the secret sauce without him knowing. Do I have any comment on this? It looks like the blood is slowly getting closer, isn't it? Or maybe not. Can't really tell that well. All right, time to get the secret sauce. I can also check the mailbox now. Anything here? No? Oh, we filled up the bucket. All right, and we're good to go. Done! My secret sauce is now in the kitchen. Note to self, don't eat with Reginaldo. Yay! All right, Reginaldo. Are we just good? I know we have to check the thing here. Also, there's a light that's flickering. What is this? Check your profile. What does this mail say? Hi, Reg. Oh, it's church. Oh, it's Gertrude's. Uh, what was the voice I gave her again? Hi, Red. Thanks for the dive. From now on, when you get water for the plants, I'll be able to st uh, stay ever so close to them. What? Like, actually? Is she gonna start showing up in the flowers or something? Is this gonna be like a flowy situation? But it was all glitched. Okay. Let's go back in, because I forget what else I needed to do today. I'm getting distracted. I know that I need to cook. Dude. Oh, go fishing. Are we going to fish something out that we don't want, though? And then cook. Axe, hammer, shovel, watering pot, fishing rod. All right, let's go. Nothing bad can happen. Nothing bad can happen, right? No, for sure not. Oh, this is cute! <laughs> I got a big one! I need to put it in the basket to keep it fresh! Yeah, we got a dead fish! Perfect. Can I fish again? It's saving me. There are no more fishies left in the pond! I really gotta get my Reginaldo voice down. Stat! We're already on day three, and it keeps changing. My hands are full. Oh, I just need to drop it. Now my hands are free. Oh, I need to pick it up with the basket because it goes, it teleports it directly to the kitchen. Let's do it. Like that the basket is just like the size of Reginaldo. There we go. Done. My fish is now in the kitchen. Now my hands are free. The last thing we got to do is cook. Cook our delicious sewer water and dead fish meal. Done. I've got all the ingredients in the pantry. Now we can prepare my special recipe. All right, let's do it, Reginaldo. Reginaldo, what do I, what do you sound like? Maybe I'll give him a cheerful voice. I don't know, we'll figure it out. Grillin' and chillin', yeah, baby. Ingredients, fish, apples, bell peppers, fish. We cook some fish. Add some apples and some bell peppers with secret sauce. Without secret sauce? I think I have an option here as to what to do with these characters and I'm going full chaos. After all, it is the secret sauce. Something bad is gonna happen though, isn't it? Yeah. All right, let's do it, Reginaldo. Oh, we've got it. Here you go. 
enjoy. Eddie's so nice, too. The characters are so nice. Mmm. It smells great. Isn't it? It isn't. Poisoned, right? No. Uh, hi, hi. No, of course not. Pals don't poison each other. Fix on your pal! I'll dig in. Oh, his little dams. Mmm. So tasty. It feels like it has a flavor, kinda. Uh, I think I need to go to the restroom. I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry, dude. I finished all my chores for today. Time to take a nap. I'll just give him a cheerful protagonist voice. How about that? Can I check on him? I guess it's occupied. What happened to your eyeballs? Anything here? I'm sorry. I feel like I'm pushing this to the point of no return. <laughs> yeah, I'm done for today. I'm done. I've done enough, honestly. More than enough. Day four, baby. <sighs> Yippee! And I can check my profile. When should we take breaks to check our profile? I'm kind of waiting to see if there's going to be something uh, better. Water the console so we can wash dishes, invite Carlitas to play video games, turn on the console, and read letters. Recipe, oh, six apples, four bell peppers, fresh fish, and secret sauce. So I already did the recipe over there to the to the right. All right, I think Carlitos is coming today. Sorry, I was doing the wazd keys instead of the, anyway. Hello? Someone at the door. Hey there. Oh, <laughs> hey. A uh, sup, youngster? What? Wanna? Wanna chat? XG? <laughs> Nickname? Carlitos? Zodiac? Virgo? Cloth? Hobby? No hobby? Something? <laughs> Gaming Carlitas. All of these characters are so fun. It's a tragedy what I'm doing to them. High scoring since 1999. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm so hyped to play with you. Reading into your vibes. You like some good old carnage. That's great! Me too! <laughs> Ever played that new game? Marguda dos Membros Desmembrados 3? Guess what? I have the game on my data! Just gotta sync it with your console, dude! Ready? Oh yeah. See you there! And there he goes. He's a little save file. Yay, we did it. Our floppy disk friend. And then we have to check our mail, which I'm really curious to do. We have to check our profile as well. So, oh, this is Jubilee. So, you know, loved the grub. It had a flavor that I will take with me to the grave. I bet you will, and it's totally my fault. <laughs> yeah. All right. I have a feeling I know what we're doing with the water and the console today. I see the future into our friends, um... Oh my god, every time I see him there, it looks like something's lying on the ground and it scares me. Alright, so this guy's here. He's got a cool sound effect. Oh, I've got dishes. Yay, let's clean these dishes! <coughs> Excuse me? <clears throat> yeah! <coughs> Sorry. 
So we did it. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> All right, we've done everything that we need to, so the last thing we can do is turn on the console. Should we just do it? Let's just do it, baby. Wait, turn on the console, but I thought the water. Yeah, water the console. <gasps> oh, so the last thing I have a feeling are options for us? Do we have an option to be good in this? Do I need the watering can? Let me just pick it up. We also have the ax. I know one day we're gonna have to get firewood. And something else, probably. Do. Now the watering pot is full, smiley face. Carlitos, wait for me, I'm coming. I'm here for you. <laughs> what happened? Did I just turn it on? I think I just turned it on. Saving. Please wait. Uploading files. Beep boop, beep boop, beep. Oh, there he is. I now have a haunted console. Where are my manners? I need to have my hands free. Oh, I need to do something here. Oh, okay. Now my hands are free. Okay, now I have to talk to him. Please wait. Uploading files. Dude, how long does it take, bro? Bro, how does it- Oh, proceed to the next day? Oh, so I do have an option to just be nice, I think. I would think, right? Or just skip all the chores, but who am I cooking for? Nobody, actually. Please wait. Uploading fu- Wait, what do I have to do with you? Water the console is the last thing? Oh. Oh, because he's uploading his personality. Time to go in. Zzz. What have you done? My dude, I don't feel so good. This is gonna be like right in our house though. A bleak reminder of everything. Can I do anything? Ah! <laughs> finished all my I finished all my chores for the day. Time to take a nap. Time to take a nap. Can I drop this? Now my hands are free for murder. All right, I think I'm all done for today. That one does not feel good. None of these deaths have felt good, actually. And we're here for day five. Hey, we got a sweep today. Should I take a break and check my profile? Let me do it, actually. Uh, no, I wanna check my profile. Cut the cake, take out the trash, chop wood. Cut the cake? Okay, we got a lot of stuff to do today. Anything here? Seven out of 10, too much water. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your rating of the game? How do I exit out of here, dude? Oh, here we go. I forgot the pause screen. Title screen, settings, quit. Let's quit. I want to check our desktop because I remember we're playing a game within a game here. Profile, and we can also check the mail inbox. Oh, 0451 Garatron documents password.txt. <gasps> It is unlocking stuff for us. Locked, I need to pick up the apple. So longing, Reginaldo, joy, and temperance. So this one, 0451, documents password. I love this. Password, 0451. <gasps> Guys. That's it. This uh, text file is going to be my confessional. Perhaps my epitaph. 
Here I gather all the information I could get. I'm not sure how to begin. A proper introduction wouldn't make any sense at this point. Who am I, or rather, who I used to be, shouldn't matter anymore. Megasoft emerged in 1999, bringing with them Jogoroto, the console, and Bemfeto, the game. Back then, no one knew where they had come from, and even though the internet at the time wasn't used as anything close to what we have today, it is still quite odd for a company to come up out of nowhere with a new console without making any fuss. I think I was probably around 12 or 13 years... Well, no, it doesn't matter. All that matters is who they were and what they've done. In years of research, I've never found out who those individuals were who formed the company, but whoever they were, they did everything they could to remain unknown, or someone did this for them. The CNPJ, you know, Brazilian's employer ID number, returns a dead end and their registered address takes you to a vacant lot. Digging through deep web boards, I found only about five people to this day that knew something about Megasoft, even though one of them said that they were aliens who came to take over Earth. By the way, I found out later reading the post from this guy that he thinks pretty much everyone is extraterrestrial. The other four knew what they were talking about, and we exchanged information for about two hours, 27 minutes, and eight seconds, never speaking to each other again afterwards. That seems like a odd time. Two, I'm gonna write this down. Two, two, seven, eight. The other four knew what they were talking about. So four, two, two, seven, and eight. That could be a password that we need later on. Especially the two, two, seven, and eight. Could be, because the four letters. Okay, after a long time gathering data in every way possible, I ended up coming up to the conclusion that I just knew way too much about all of this. It took me some time to accept it, but after that, even as careful as I was, I know I don't have much time left. Sorry, I need to stick all the facts Stick to the facts, and I mustn't get delusional about the future, no matter how close it feels now. At first, the company was made out of just a few guys with a dream to make video games, just ordinary people running after what they wanted to do. Unfortunately for them, it was very hard to achieve the success they desired, especially without any money to back them up. Back then, the odds of a self-made man just making games were extremely low, and they knew that very well. For that very reason, they were willing to do anything just to have a chance at living the dream. And... As it was, this very anguish that led them to shake uh, the wrong hands without caring about the consequences. During that time, they were being watched by, well, a group. You see, it is already almost impossible to find information about Megasoft itself. There's absolutely nothing to be found about this said group. I believe it to be some kind of secret society formed by a select few powerful individuals, perhaps businessmen from the industry. But saying anything... More would be just speculation. They contacted Megasoft and brought them into their circle. What they promised or for what price is unknown. By judging by the success of Bemfeto had at the time, it's not hard to picture. There's no information about Megasoft after the events of 1999. No announcements, no new releases, and no mentions. However, those who remember what they did know that, in some way, both they and their legacy still lingers. I know, I remember, and that is why I'm writing this dossier, regardless of the consequences. Is this from the lady who sent us the email? So we also have Corporation Jokoroto launch, so this is going to be our lore, for sure. Let me open the profile. So Corporation is 1312, and then uh, launch is 1999, but backwards. So I definitely think that we're going to have to find numbers in here. 0451 1999 backwards. All right, let's open these documents up, baby. Corporation. This one is 1312. The Jogoroto was handled, was a handheld console produced and distributed by Megasoft in 1999. Being around the size of a calculator, it featured one single screen positioned just above its eight buttons. At the bottom of the console, there was a slot for inserting the game cartridges. There are reports that the console uh, was available in the colors yellow, blue, red, black, and white. I've never heard of anyone successfully opening a Jokoroto, so its interior remains a mystery. Interesting. And one with a very particularly particular aspect, its power source. You see, Jogoroto wasn't powered by conventional batteries. An old article found on the in the Hora Popular newspaper I could find... Uh, the console was described to be equipped with an automatic charging system that works through sensors triggered the moment you hold the console. Whether said sensors are real or not, I cannot say, but following, they mentioned something that has been reported to me in every contact I had with someone who actually held a Jotaro, and then finally, it finally got clear to me. Interesting. So is it being charged by your soul? 
Um, I gotta go down here. And then it finally got clear to me. In fact, the console's power source seemed to be external. The player, that's what I'm thinking. Every individual who had any contact with Jogoroto, either directly or indirectly, reported a sense of exhaustion, even after a few minutes holding the console. I've contemplated several hypotheses regarding the energy absorption mechanism, from heat exchange and breakdown of glucose to some others, that I must admit are far less orthodox and plausible. But without the ability to measure it, the mechanisms behind Jogoroto's battery, or rather the lack of it, will likely remain elusive. In attachment, a photo I found of the Jogoroto by the name jogoroto.png, the password is 1337. 1337. Jogoroto PNG. All right, let's open it up. Here it is. 1337. What's in the back? What's in the back? And what is it? That's pointing towards something, but it can't. Oh, I can zoom, can I? Do I want to, though? P R O. <gasps> Wait. Did that just glitch? Did you guys see that, or are my eyes going crazy? <gasps> it's glitching. And there's a person there. No, I don't want to turn on sticky keys, please. Hold on. No, because I'm clicking shift to zoom in. So it says P-R-O-V up in the corner. P-R-O-V-X, maybe? Two? I don't know. And then we got to figure out a code. I don't think I can interact with this at all, can I? Oh, I can move around, though. Huh. Okay, I want to know what that is. And then we have launch two, which is 1999. So 9991. As far as I know, Ben Feta was the only game ever released on the Jogoroto. Presenting 32-bit-like graphics, the game features a protag protagonist, Reginaldo, the only playable character. In control of Reginaldo, the player must perform daily tasks around his home on planet B-613. The concept seems simple enough, but the captivating aesthetics conceal the strange effects it causes on the players. Weakness, dizziness, and anxiety are just some of the commonly reported symptoms of those who claim to have played the game. In addition, some medical reports I managed to access portray other, more severe symptoms. Some noteworthy behaviors observed in children after playing what, uh, by description, seems to be bem fato include nightmares, auditory and visual hallucinations, and the feeling of being constantly followed. There is a report about a 10-year-old boy who, according to his parents, after spending some time playing a cute game on his handhold console, got up to walk towards the balcony and stared at absolutely nothing for hours. And that's still not all of it. Between 1999 and 2000, several cases of missing children were reported. Most of these cases eventually went cold and a whole lot of info about the events were lost. I managed to access some of them. Uh, what do they all have in common? In all cases, when asked about when the children were last seen, the answer given to the investigators is always the same. They were there playing with their new portable video game. Attached is a photo I found of Ben Fato's cartridge by the name cartridge.png. The password is 7819. 7819 cartridge. Let's open it up. 7819. Okay. Prova N number. Oh, that's what that says. Prova number 1X. Number 1X, which would be nine, right? In Roman numerals. Oh, wait. No, I wanted to zoom in here. And then only J and R are seen here, and they're pointing towards it. Megasoft. J, R, and then X on the Bem Feto thing. On the cartridge. J, R. I'm writing down any clues I get, just in case these are going to be puzzles for us to find out. Is something glitching? Wait. I thought it... Yeah, Megasoft is starting to glitch. Okay, let me um, get out of this. Polly Bias, and then Amigo, Cicada, and then Crimes. <laughs> crimes? Password. Okay. So I think that's what we got for now. How many... Hold on. Let me look at the manual, because how many friends do we have in this one anyway? Bem Fato manual. So we had here. So we've already gotten rid of three friends, though. There's one more that's a cake. <laughs> So we got to do that. How are we going to open the last documents? Let's go back into the game, shall we? We have our settings. We have the recycle bin. Nothing in the recycle bin, though. 
I'm a little nervous. That's all that we got, right? Got other things going on? Hmm. So we got a haunted video game that we're playing within a video game. I think I can zoom in here. Should I zoom in? Mega Soft. Joker Roto. Oh, I can't zoom in while I'm actually playing the game. I think those are just for the pictures. All right, let's continue. For sure. Mega Soft 1999. I'm excited. I'm going to put my little clue sheet over here to the side. Hello. Oh, I forgot about this. Forgot about the nightmare that was yesterday in the game. All right, it's fifth day. Sweep the house, take out the trash, chop wood, check mailbox, and cut the cake. We got a recipe here. All right, let's sweep, guys. Got to clean up after our messy day yesterday. We got a rag to help clean up the blood that you spilled. Put that away. Yay! <laughs> Can I put this down? Now my now my hands are free. His voice is just gonna be like 10 different voices, okay? Because he's possessed. That's what I'm going with. Seven out of ten, too much water, so that's the same. Let's take the trash out. <laughs> Another bestie came to visit. Hey there. Can I throw this away first? Hold on, before I talk to you. Yay! I did it. Are some of my fence posts higher than they should be? That's such a random thing to notice, but do you guys see that? Are those always like that? That's odd to me. Yeah, some of the fen fence posts are higher. Uh, let me check the mail really quick. Okay, I can check my profile. Oh, so that's how we get the codes from yesterday. Hey, dude, surfing the whole web a lot. Thanks for inviting me to play MDMD3. I'd never seen such realistic eff effects. It was lit. Is that going to be something? MDMD. I know that he, um, that's an abbreviation for whatever the game was called. I'm still writing it down just in case. So that was from Carlitos. And he's got the game consoles around there. Cool, dude. All right, let's meet our new friend. Yeah. <laughs> He's got a cute little heart on his sleeve. All right, dude. Jeez. I didn't even see you down there. Yeah, you're such an itsy bitsy. You live here all alone. Maybe. It's not, is it not dangerous? I think it is, you know? Personally, I'm not really comfortable walking around by myself. But then I heard a weird noise. It looked like your roof is damaged, you see? Oh, it is. Why? That's so alarming. Someone might get hurt. What if it had fallen on your head? Have you thought of that? It is always good to have someone to rely on. That's why I came. Oh my! Where are my manners? I am Clarice. It's a pleasure. And my motto is, safety first. Clarice. Hi there. She's too cute. <laughs> Are you like a robot? We're going to be a great team. I could fix your thing. We could build things together. I'm great at that. I like a lot of things. I just don't like dangerous things like pointy and sharp objects, especially axes. They could hurt you. But now that I'm here, you won't need to be afraid. I promise to protect you. <laughs> I'll be staying right here. I want to respect your personal space. Oh no. All oh, these characters are such sweethearts. I need to check my to-do list really quick. Did I? I did everything off, so I have to chop wood and then cut the cake. All right, and then after we do this, we'll exit the game and then check on... I guess we can get both... We'll get the mail from tomorrow after we finish the tasks for today. And then we'll check the two different files there that we have in documents. All right, I gotta grab this, the axe. When am I gonna use the hammer? Oh, do I have to use the hammer to fix the thing? Be careful! That is dangerous! Someone might get hurt!
Stop it. Stop it. I'm so scared. I'm going to do it here. I'm just going to chop the tree. Yay! Our little sociopath. What a cutie. Now my hands are free. Can I pick these up? I like that the heartbeat is just part of the music now. Do, 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 do. Do I need to bring the firewood with me? I'm gonna see if I have to collect it with this. The music is so cool. It sounds like a ghost is serenading me, which is probably what's happening. Done! Now I have all I need to fix my roof. Oh, I do? Do I just need to get the hammer now? All right, let's grab the hammer, baby, and go up and fix the roof. And then we'll grab the ax again. Oh, can I not do it here? Since I can't use the hammer, I think we're uh, destined to do something else with our free time. Something less fun. Though I have a feeling it's fun for Reginaldo. Be careful. That is dangerous. Someone might get hurt. God. I'm sorry. I only wanted to protect you. I finished all my chores for today. Time to take a nap. Not a cake. You are weird. You are one weird kid. <laughs> Not a cake. All right. Uh, can I fix my roof though? Maybe he'll just fix it tomorrow. Oh, I bet that's gonna be on our to-do list for tomorrow. That's probably what it is. Now my hands are free. And everything is done. Wait, what? Wait, I've never checked this afterwards. We get everything done and it says Ben Feto. All right, should we go to sleep? Yep, I'm all done for the day. Yeah, because it'll save me, I think. Then I got to open the pause menu. This is day six, right? Yeah. There were six apples that we collected. I don't know why I remember that. Oh my God, your picture changed. Check your profile. Okay, let's look at this. Repair the roof, hammer the gato. No, I know what that word means. I know what gato means. Uh, -uh. <laughs> no. Def cleanse yourself before the ritual, read letters and worship the fridge. Worship the fridge. You know what? We're gonna pause the game. We'll come back. Wait, no, I have to, wait, hold on. Let me see if I can get the letter. So if I get the letter first, no music. Okay, that's what I needed to see. We'll pause it after this. Hi, little one. Thank you so much for what you've done for me. Now my two halves can protect each other. Stop making me so sad. I hate that there's letters sent that make it seem like they wanted this to happen. Okay, now we're gonna quit. And then here, open up the profile. Uh, so this one is 1981 and it's also glitched. 1981, I'll leave this. What else do we have? C Care is Clarice. So we do have a, uh, those must be the two different things that we got. 1981, documents, Libius, 19, 81. The Megasoft Amigo was a small figure in the shape of Reginaldo that worked through the use of near-field communication chip. When brought close to the Jogoroto with a Bemfato cartridge in it, the figure would allegedly interact with the game generating some new features. Just like Bemfato and the Jogoroto, the Amigos have disappeared and have been forgotten. They're probably the rarest and most uncharted piece of Megasoft's history. I've never managed to learn much about the Amigo, but there was in fact a time 
Uh, in fact, one time on an online board about old toys that a guy described something that sounded like an amigo when he said the following. Um, OXO Chaplin Verdex Ox says, yeah, dude, there was, yeah, dude, there were some really bizarre toys in the 90s. Back then, I remember the day I went to a friend's house to play video games and he had this weird little figure that somehow could interact with the game, said he. But on our way to test it, being a really clumsy kid as I was, I stomped on a Lego, another awfully dangerous toy, and ended up pushing my friend to the floor. The figure rolled down the stairs and shattered all over. When we came close to it, we saw that the inside of it, there was a black stake that looked like a dagger. I still wonder what I was thinking. What was that thing? Uh-oh. The nature of the interaction between the Amigo and Bemfeto game remains unknown. Attached is a picture I found of an Amigo by the name Amigo.png. The password is 7777. That one's easy enough to remember. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. 7777. <gasps> Guys, do I even have to tell you? Hold on, wait. There's also an arrow over here on the left side of the picture. And then there's a hand underneath the bed. Is there anything else we see? And then there's Bem Feito. Or the Amigo. Okay. Is it gonna glitch at all? I don't think so. All right. So then we have the cicada and article.png. Are we gonna be able to open these? I sure hope so. I really hope so. Um, can I delete this? Return to desktop. Let's just go in. Ben Feto. I'm ready. We've run out of friends, though, according to the manual. Let's continue. Oh, yeah. So this is the day. We go in here. Was that different going into the area? Worship the fridge. I don't know how to do that. We do have to repair the roof. Hammer the gato. <sighs> Cleanse yourself before the ritual. I'm assuming that's going to be in the sewer. So let's get the hammer first over here. Yay! Well, I didn't get a choice of what to choose. Okay, at least he's fixing it. How are you fixing it? Oh, okay, perfect. Yay. All right, I have to hammer something. Where is it? No, I don't want to do this. You're really going to make me do this? What does he say without it? He didn't want to put it down. I can't make him put it away. I can't. He didn't have anything to say about this. Can I go in here? How the heck am I supposed to cleanse myself before the ritual? I don't like this one bit. One more try here. What do I do? Cleanse yourself before the ritual. Worship the fridge. How do I worship the fridge, perhaps? Oh, that's how I cleanse myself. <laughs> okay. He's doing a little dancey. No. No. No, because that was all my tasks for today. So what are we doing? I hate that I can make him walk towards me. I have chills.
Okay. Check your profile. What? Oh god. Oh god. Okay, can I exit? Can I exit out of the game, please? Actually. <laughs> Quit. Let's check her email. We must have something new. Profile? Do you think I got any emails during this too? It didn't say I got an email. 3301. Cicada and then 1001 is crimes. 3301 1001. Okay. They're all glitchy. And we've got a ton of other things that are actually still locked, so we still have more to uncover. Cicada is going to be. 3301. This article is one of the few physical pieces of evidence about Megasoft that still exists. It has written by Jorge Cordosa, a published and published in the Ora Popular newspaper. Ora Popular was a low circulation periodical that only lasted for a few years. Its original prints are scarce and hard to come by. Jorge Cardosa was probably a pseudonym for one of the writers, since there is no information about anyone in that name who worked at said paper. Text is the story I found cut out and scanned by the name article.png. The password is 2459. 2459. Translated transcription of the scan. Is there anything scary that's happening right now? Okay, good, I because I, I can't read the original text. <clears throat> As is <clears throat> newspaper name, or a popular written by Jorge Cordosa, date 50, uh, 10, 1999. A giant is born. National company launches Jogaroto, the Brazilian portable console. Headquarters in Sao Tome das Letras. Uh, Minas Gerais, Brazil. Uh, Megasoft is emerging as a new player in the Brazilian game market with their portable video game Jogaroto. With no marketing whatsoever and an unexpected release, Jogaroto quickly became a success. Its main and so far only game is Ben Feito, an adventure in which you take control of Reginaldo, the solo inhabitant of a little planet called B613, helping him accomplish his house chores and make friends. One of the console's innovative features is that it doesn't really rely on batteries like its competitors. Instead, it has an automatic charging system that works through sensors that are triggered when the console is being held. This makes it ideal for extended periods of play, although our team, for some reason, felt physically drained after testing it. Available in blue, red, yellow, black, and white, Jogaroto can be found in several toy stores around the country. Note, our staff tried to approach the company to discuss upcoming projects, but we were unable to locate any means of contacting them. Millennial Bug worries the international community. The Millennium Bug is the given name by experts to an unexpected error in computer operating systems during the transition to the year 2000. Due to using the, a date counting system based on only two digits during the new year, computers will update the date to 1900, causing chaos in numerous databases of government systems, companies, and even banks. Oh, that's interesting. One of the main problems created by the bug is the possible failure in the nuclear weapons systems worldwide. Diplomats have warned that a malfunction in the defense system could trigger a false alarm of an attack on a country potentially causing widespread panic and lead to a, a, retaliatory, a retaliatory attack. The G7, a group made up mostly of economically advanced countries, is studying joint solutions to the problem. They must have included that um, millennium bug. Oh, as a thing? Also, because I just realized there's a date and time down in the corner of our computer. I wonder if I have to change it to like 1924 or something. Do you think there's something along those lines? That has to be what it is. 1900. Causing chaos in numerous chats and databases or maybe change it to 2000. Do you think I'm able to do that? We also have crimes. So crimes is going to be 1001. No, Rodin's The Thinker doesn't have his hand sitting on his forehead, and Nelson Mandela didn't die in prison. If you've got any recollection of one of these things being true, you are experiencing the phenomenon known as the Mandela Effect. This term was first coined by the writer Fiona Broom in 2010 and describes a collective false memory when several people share the same incorrect memory about an event. Now picture this. Instead of a false memory, what if there was no memory at all? Such an event I give the name Reginaldo Effect. Even though all my research so far shows that Ben Feito was one of the best selling games at its launch, the number of people who have an, any indirect memory of the game is laughable. 
The thing is, it wasn't just Megasoft's physical traces that had gone dim. Any and all memories associated with the company, their relationships, or any of their products have disappeared. From the children who have played the game to the parents who had bought them, everyone had their memories completely erased about everything that involved Megasoft. From all of this, my only conclusion is that the tragedy around Megasoft is far more complex than we think of. I can't say how many things could have turned out differently had they not been led down this path. Uh, trying to figure out... What was made because of the greed or just hopelessness is sheer futility, and whichever is the case, I'm sure they didn't expect to pay such a heavy price and be completely erased from history. Hmm. Uh, here's a parenthesis. At the end of 1999, still a child, I got in a car accident while traveling with my parents. The accident caused a brain damage that led to a case of retrograde amnesia. So that, for the next coming years, my memories of what happened in the previous months were inaccessible to me. I don't know how people forgot about Megasoft and their legacy, but I believe my memory loss prevented me from going through the same process. All that remains now is the hope that there can be more people like me who have somehow had their memories protected and can fight for the truth in the future. Ah, interesting. So because she had the retrograde amnesia, that helps her remember Megasoft slightly? Or do you think Megasoft, the game company, and Ben Fato actually causes amnesia? There, that should be enough. I have already sorted out all the files about Jogoroto and Ben Fato and other related information. Reviewing my writings, I have to admit it colors me impressed with how I was able to write so clearly even though I was constantly shaking. Sometimes when I look at a blank screen, I can still see him. Sometimes as I listen to the silence, I feel the echo of his la laughter. Crap. Anyway, the next step is to zip everything up and upload it. I believe that is the safest way to get this dossier to someone out there without being intercepted is to mask the folder with some random game and wait for people to download it. Wait, as some other random game? But this wasn't a random game. It was Ben Fato. My hopes may be futile, but I have nothing left to do but pass this on before I'm unable to. If you're reading this, protect yourself. Be discreet and careful. Forgive me for putting all this weight on your shoulders, but I know I don't have much time left. I can feel how close they are to me. I can feel how close he is to me. I hope you get questions to the answers I failed. To the, I hope you get answers to the question I failed to answer. What does this say? Is there any way I can decrypt this? TIA8... Oh, that's going to be tough to decrypt. I guess I can still take a picture of it. Let me take a quick picture. Just in case, but I'm assuming that's going to be the signature of whoever this was. So that's crimes. Let me check my inbox really quick. This is really interesting. I have a feeling that the kids who went missing probably went too far in the Ben Fato like universe. Okay, so no new things, but the people who didn't just had their memories erased because of the way that it was um taking their energy, ROMs, Bemfato. And I can't open this compressed file. Read the manual 366. Let me read the manual again. Cuz before we go back in uh that's Bemfato. I don't need this. I need the this one. 366 error code. Uh, not equipped for execution of this file format. Beware. Why should I beware? Press Z or delete uh, key to delete any files at will. Can I delete these documents? Forbidden? Refer to the manual for more info. Huh. In the profile? Can't access any of those. Manual. Oh, can I delete the ROM? This? Forbidden. Z? Delete? Z? Okay, I'm trying everything. Let's just go back in. Let's go back into the game. What do we have to lose? Our soul? Maybe? <laughs> Alright. Oh god, I always forget when I'm reading about the lore. I just can't go to sleep. It says check profile. Seven out of ten, too much water. Oh wait, okay, okay, this is where I did leave off. Wait, can I check this? No, I just have to go out.
Hey, dude. Hey, hey, dude. Hey, stop. Hey, stop doing that. Hey, dude. Hey, hey, I don't want you to do that anymore. Actually. Um. Is this your true self forming? Can I turn you around? My mailbox is over there in the river of blood. <laughs> what? Okay, 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 I gotta open this. I gotta open this. Check your profile. Ignorance, gato, what does that mean? Oh, not the cat! Rare, there's a big apple up there. What is going on? I really want to check the profile. Okay, let's check the perimeter. There's a ton of apples. I see you guys. What's here? Oh my god. Okay, let's check the lore. Should we check the lore? It could give us insight as to how to deal with whatever we just looked at. Oh, I want to. Okay, I want to. I can't. Oh, I can't. I can't. What am I looking at? I can go left or right. Let's go left. We're going backwards. Hit a wall. I don't like this. Hi! Proud of yourself? Was it worth it? No, there's no point in arguing with you. You don't even care. What are you saying? You didn't even think twice. You didn't even think twice. You made me murder my besties with my own hands. I think you did that on your own. Also, it was on the to-do list. Gertrude, Jubaloo, Cardalus, Clarice, even the cute kitten. Oh, uh, you think you had no choice? Oh, all that is written must be followed. Is that it? Yeah, <laughs> no. <laughs> so how about this? You will stay trapped here forever, alien. After all, you became responsible forever for what you have tamed. Oh no. I'm so dead. Can't go this way. Hey, Ben Fado. Hey. Hey, good to see you. Hey, hey, so also... I got new mail. I also have stuff from my profile, didn't I? Ignorance, Gato, forever you became responsible. Forever for this. Let me check my mailbox. Can I start the game again? Can I start the game again and be like, angelic? Like, just to send him to sleep and not have the murder stuff happening? Reginaldo sent me a mail. Hi, BFF. Your friend Reginaldo is here. Do you think you could get away? You're now my BFF. I will never be alone again. We will be together forever. When you're alone, I will be there. When you're having fun, I will be there. When you're asleep, I will be there. Okay, Re Re Reginaldo. This is glitching. Corrupted file? It's corrupted now. 
Can I go into documents? Can I delete these now? File forbidden. Is there anywhere else I can put in information? We have the Bam Bem Fato manual. Huh. All right, let's go back into the game. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. It's a maze. Do I just have to go as fast as I can through this? He keeps finding me, though. Am I ever going to be able to get out? Wait. Let me back in. Okay. Let's go down here. We gotta just keep moving. Wait! Am I supposed to be able to make it out of this maze? Or no? Wait, what's going on? Oh! Is it that I'm touching the walls? I must be touching the walls. That must be what's going on. Okay, let me try it again then. We're gonna be extra careful, because I'm like, why is sometimes... Okay. No! No, so it's not that I'm touching the walls. Oh, I can erase it now! Okay, so there's nothing else here. Recycle bin? It's not supported. Wait, no? Wait, stop! Are you sure you want to delete this file? Yes. Yes. Hey, buddy. Please respond! Send support now. Help needed. Attention. Mayday, mayday, mayday. <gasps> Wait, are you reading what this says? Running self-diagnosis? Please respond. Requesting immediate assistance. Wait, what are you saying? What did you say to me? No, stop. There's too much to pay attention to. The OS is restarting. Oh, come on. I love games like this. Okay, let me in. Is he gonna still be here? Did it just start over again? Then Fato, mail inbox. I don't know that I can just delete it off the bat. I suppose I can try that. I also think making the date different in the corner, like if I change my computer's date, that could definitely be something. Like 1999, he's still here. So do I just open it again? So it didn't just like restart my game. That wasn't an ending. Oh yeah. New game and settings. Now what happens here? He looks normal. Can I just take you to sleep and not do anything? Proceed to the next day. Yeah, I'm all done for today. I'm just gonna ignore all of the tasks outright because that's the easiest thing to do. And then another time we'll finish the tasks but not do the murder ones. Hey there. Do, 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 do. At least I know I have a choice now. Proceed, yeah, I'm all done for the day. Maybe this is, maybe it's like technically a continuation, but we'll still be able to get something different going on here. Looks normal. Day four. Is there something under the bed? Oh no, that's just his bed. We've got dishes here. We've got a ton, but we haven't done anything. I'm just ignoring everything. Day five. How many days was it? It was six, right? I'm all done for the day. You can't trick me into playing your game. You said I didn't have a choice? Well, I'm choosing to be lazy. Repair the roof, read letters. Oh, so it just takes away all of the stuff. I'm all done for the day. 
I'll do another run after this where I actually complete the tasks. I just don't do the final one. Why'd it still get slow? What a week, huh? Today is off day, hashtag catter day, seventh day. That's substantially cuter. I don't have the choice to sleep right now. I have to go outside. What is he doing? Ah, guess I'm back to my usual loneliness. After all, I always end up alone. Oh, so this is what happens when we just completely ignore everybody? Should I check the letters? We've got some letters. Gotcha! Don't scare me like that! Oh my god, that scared me! I thought he was talking to us! Hey there! Hi! Reggie! I brought some seeds for your garden. Let's make it look lovely. <laughs> She's so cute. Uh, you took quite a while with uh, those chores. But now we can cook lots of treats together. A sup, my dude? <laughs> it's going everywhere. Now that you're free, why don't we play the new interesting monstery? The M D B S T A A. <laughs> Uh, yeah, let's do it. So you can always count on me to protect you, little one. Aw, oh, this is so sweet. This is, this version of it is very sweet. Purr, purr. <laughs> wow. I never thought I could make so many besties. Thank you so much for the adventure. Now let's all have a ton of fun together. Aw, cute. Thanks, bestie. You're welcome, bestie. Wait a minute. Thanks, bestie. Find all the little secrets of Ben Fato, the 90s classic. I gotta figure out a way to get these other secrets. I'm so, I'm so, like, intrigued now. We opened up all the documents, I know that much. Okay, well, let's just open up the game again. Oh! Can I reset? Also, the cat is so cute. Can I reset? Hey, bestie! Our journey is over! Thanks for your help! Thank you so much for all your help, bestie! Our time together is over now! What just happened? Did one of them go away? The nose is gone. No, I'm... At the end of the day, I'm still just a murderer, huh? Please stop, bestie! It all ended well! Aren't you happy for us? Happy for me? Not the cat! No! Please! I'm finally here with my friends! Finally having a chance to rest! Please! I beg you, don't make me lose everything again! What if we say no? Should I just click no? Thanks, bestie! What if I do it again? Wait, you just restarted? Dude. <laughs> All right, let's go back in. All right, I gave you a chance. I gave you a chance. Our journey is over. Yeah, yeah, about that. <clears throat> I have to be horrible for a second for the achievement. I have to do unspeakable things to you as a video game character for the achievement. Murder! I'm finally here with the friends, finally having a chance to rest. Okay. Please, I beg you, don't make me lose everything again.
Yes. Are you going to be mad at me? Is he going to say anything? This is just it? This is it for us? He didn't have anything to say to me. So we're just back in the game? So wait, does that give us any... I got an achievement for that, but was that just an achievement? I feel like I'm missing something. <clears throat> this didn't feel like a solid... Like, yes, you did it. That's an ending. Also, we never got to use the shovel. Oh. <laughs> he looks so happy. <laughs> what do I use this for, buddy? Nothing? Oh, Gato, check your profile. Did I just get an achievement? It didn't shovel anything? <laughs> okay, so that's something. Okay, so because I played through this and I'm a little bit at a loss, I looked at the achievements. There's only three that I haven't gotten, one of which is the one where it says find all of the secrets. So I'm gonna see if I find all of the achievement, if that's going to give us anything different here at the end of the game. And if there's not, then I'm not sure what to do to get like a solid ending, especially cause like we haven't had the credits roll, but the credits were also like within the files here. So I don't know if it's just like that kind of anticlimactic ending, not that the other ending was um, not climactic, but I was never able to finish through the labyrinth because he kept stopping me. So I, I, anyway, I'm gonna do some secret hunting. Okay, so this is one. Yeah, ABCs, I need the basket to pick up apples. <laughs> okay, so we can't just pick them up with our bare hands. Okay, we're back here. We have El Gato and, um, instead of grabbing the hammer, first and foremost, we're gonna try and talk to him. Got double the ellipses, triple the ellipses. Mo, I know what you have done. Well, I gotta do something else, I'm sorry, but that got me the achievement and that got me all the achievements actually. Okay, I'm back at the maze part and I've tried going backwards, I've tried going forwards, I've tried moving to the left, to the right. I mean, I can continue to try and move through the maze, but I just don't think he's going to let me. I mean, he might, but I'm not getting my hopes up. Let me look at the profile since we have all of these. Uh, one only understands the thing that one tames, then coming back to say goodbye. So I got all the achievements here. Let me check my mail inbox really quick. But other than that, I don't know. Like, is this the end? Because I've gotten all the achievements of the game. It just feels, it feels like I'm missing something. It feels like I missed something. Okay, I'm setting my time to December 31st, 1999, and two minutes before midnight. Okay, you can see it on the screen. I'm gonna see if this does anything. Because remember in the one profile, well, we have time here to sit and chat. In the one document that we got, the other thing is the two hours, 27 minutes, and eight seconds, which I think was in the password, right? Yeah, Microsoft emerged in 1999. We exchanged information for about two hours, 27 minutes, and eight seconds, never speaking to each other again afterwards. So I'm wondering if I have to set it to a certain date and time. And then it says Prova number nine. What does Prova mean in Portuguese also? Okay, we have about 15 seconds. I'm just looking over all of this stuff again. See, this is also encrypted and it's different. I don't know. All right, let's see if this... <laughs> Happy New Year! In two seconds. Okay, that didn't do anything. <gasps> Guys! I knew it would... This folder is empty, old friends. What does that say? I wish I knew what that said. Wait, what is this? Wait, okay, I'm actually excited because I've been sitting here going, what do I do? Why are you laughing at me? Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Scan QR code, hold on. I have it ready. What are you gonna show me? I got it. I got it. I got it. It showed up. It showed up. It had to show up when he smiled at us. 
Wait, it says it's installing something. Hold on. Let me let me copy this link and, and send it to myself so that uh, we can look at it together. Okay, here it is. The link says, says something, I think, in Portuguese, and then it says starting session for robot. So let's do it. Initiating Meganet Depth's intrusion sequence? What are you doing? Hacking device awakens. Virtual tendrils extend, infiltrating hidden data caches, subverting 14 years of virtual guardians. Resistance futile. Each keystroke resonates with the power of a thousand storms. <gasps> I'm not human. Finally, I get to be a cyber robot queen like I've always wanted to be. Ooh, Meganet Archive, sensitive data old friend. Who are you? asked 11111. I am blank, said blank. Come play with me, I'm so sad and alone, proposed blank. I cannot play with you, said blank, for I am not tamed. Then there's this one. I'm looking for besties. What does tame mean? It's a long forgotten thing. It means to create a bond, said blank. A bond? Exactly. To me, you still are nothing more than a little boy who is just like a hundred thousand other little boys. And I have no need of you. And you, on your part, have no need of me. And I have no need of you. And you, on your part, have no need of me. Blank, 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 blank. Like a hundred thousand other blank. But if you tame me, then we shall eat need each other. To me, you will be unique in all the world. To you, I shall be unique in all the world. And there's something missing at the bottom. Can I move this around at all? Oh, I can scroll down when I'm looking at this. Okay. We'll close out of that one. Or can I just open this one next? There's a busty. I think they tamed me. There's a little fox crying. Please tame me, said blank. I want to, said number one, but I have not much time. I have besties to discover and a great many things to understand. Only one understands the thing that one tames, said blank. If you want a friend, tame me. What must I do, asked blank. It takes rights? What's a right? It's a long forgotten thing. It's what makes one day different from other days. One hour from other hours. Okay, wait, I missed the wrong thing. Also, is this binary? Do I need to look this up? The ones and zeros tend to be that. Um, ah, said zero. I shall cry. It is your own fault, said one. I never wished you any sort of harm, but you wanted me to tame you. I know, said zero. But you're going to cry, said one. I know, said zero. Go see your besties once more. You will understand that yours are unique in the world. Then come back to me. Farewell, and I will make you a present of a secret. Okay. Um, so that's that one. And then we have goodbye, said one. Goodbye, said zero. And now here is my secret. It is only with the heart that one can see rightly. What is essential is invisible to the, the eye. I am forever responsible for this, one repeated, so that he would be sure to remember. Where is he now? Where did he go? Why did he abandon me? Why did he forget me? Cried zero. Yours forever, down at the bottom. And it's playing a mu uh, music. It's a lullaby. Shine, my only sunshine. All right, we'll close out of that. Also, there's an eyeball up here looking at us. Can I do anything with you? It's an image. Can I, um, is there anything to highlight on this page? I don't think so. Troubleshooting for broken links, search engine. Oh, there's a search engine that I can look for too, but let's look at this stuff. So that was sensitive data, confidential sender. Hi, Kevy, have you ever heard of Bem Fato? Oh, for you dearest, and then redacted. It's redacted and all of those are broken. So I can search for things. And then it also says run down here at the bottom. Let me search for some things. One of the things I have written down was MDM 
D3, I think. Does that search for anything? I don't think so. How do I search for this? Okay, uh, what else can we look for? We can look for KB. Does he blank butterflies? What? Saved data? Oh. Wait, was this one of the lines? Wait, was this one of the lines? Does he like butterflies? Oh, what is this? Oh, I'm so fascinated. I remember something about butterflies. Is it collect? Ah! Okay, KB, this is more data. KB, AKA OI, uh, Cabby. 36, game developer trained by Megasoft. She was the developer? I feel like that's a twist, right? I thought she was just someone who sent it to us. Or, or was she and she was just the new developer that did the emulator for it? Because I know that that was a part, but was she the original developer? Subject has, so performance profile. Subject has shown a growing interest in developing the project and has completed all the initial stages without asking concerning questions. So far, it does not seem to be any evidence that she still suspects the nature of the game. Even being directly exposed, she still believes it all to be some kind of gimmick. No disruptions read on the status. We received intercepted communication between Cabby and her team. On said communication, she reported recurring dreams of one, she will remain in our primary external channel of one. And I can't highlight anything here. She will remain on our, okay. Sensitive data, sit rep. Uh, keep surveilling all communication between her and her team. Report any signs of suspicion, readable symptoms, and or self-awareness. Conclusion, subject stable. Task incomplete. And then question mark, question mark, question mark. What is essential is invisible to the eye. Can you, wait, it says, oh, can you answer me if you remember? Okay. Wait, what? Can you answer me if you remember? What does that mean? So can I search for more things? Can you answer me? Wait, oh, what? What if I type in yes? It's not yes. Bemfeto? No. Uh, we also have Fabi. Oh God, what does his voice sound like? Ooh, okay. Fabiola Mesquita, unit profile. So we're looking at people. Name Fabiola Mesquita, aka Fabi37, Professora, um, GPS in Brazil. Okay, performance profile. Um, F. Mesquita is one of the main subjects currently under observation. It was confirmed in previous reports that she is one of the original players from 1999 um, and was able to retain some previously reported memories about that period. The return of these memories is attributed to engaging with the documents received from Fabio. Fabio, I'm writing that down. Okay, um, Mesquita was also the first of the original players to have contact with the relaunch in which contributed to an accelerated manifestation of symptoms. Although we use her as a channel to initiate the development of this next phase, her status would be updated to threat. Sensitive data attachment. Lowe's communication excerpt. Fabiola says, hey, um, do you remember that game I mentioned once? Not the one, or the one I found on a ROM but couldn't run it. Uh, Natalia. Nat Natalia. Natalia Freitas. Okay, of course I do, lol. I couldn't shut up out about it, about it for a whole week. Ha ha ha, don't be a a-hole. Um, but hey, I finally found the damn thing. It looks like someone made a port of it. It's really weird. The really, really, it's really weird thing is what I found on the inside of it. Screenshot of an email sent to the developer. Um, check this out. Wow, Fabi, that's cool. I didn't know you managed to reach the devs. Did they use the game? Did they used in the game as a thank you? Oh, like put her in the game? Uh, that's what cut me out. I never sent that email. But it's still a huge coincidence. You know the name, even the college info. It really gave me chills. What? Yeah, that's creepy, dude. They even used your photo. Call 911. What do you mean? No, seriously, what do you mean? The profile picture in the email, that's the one you took on campus a while back, right? Ugh, now I don't know if you're trying to tease me or if you've lost your glasses. I'm serious, Fabi. Just look at it. It's the same photo. You even posted it on your main. 
all right, you can stop with these jokes now. Also, the girl looks nothing like me. I have no idea who she is. And then Nathalia says, uh, dude. So is that the amnesia coming in? Sensitive data sit rep. Keep sending emails of her condition and try to uh, confirm the appearance of advanced symptoms. Day terror and prosopagnosia? Uh, is that supposed to be prognosis? Is that just in um, Portuguese? Day terror. Day terror. Prevent any attempts at the subject trying to force communication. Prepare intervention measures in case the situation escalates. Conclusion subject is a mid level threat. Task incomplete. The rep. Okay. And then the last one the question mark, question mark, question mark. It is only with the heart that one can see rightly. I'm writing these down. Wait, actually, can I copy these? I think I can. No, I can't. Can you answer me if you remember? And it says the same thing again. So I think this is taking me back. So it is only with the heart that one can see rightly. Sorry. Okay, I have that written down. It looks like it's part of a bigger picture here. It is only with the heart that one can see rightly. And then the other one was said, what is essential is invisible to the eye. Aviola. Okay. So that's that. What happens if I put in Fabio? I get an error message. What do I do here? Can I do anything? Up here it says system unstable. The name of the person from the chat says Natalia Freitas. And we get another 404 page. Oh, but up here it says subject not prompt for initiation yet instead. Um, who else? Should we look up Fox? Fox was in there, right? Whoa, Fox gives me another error page and it says not up to you up here in exclamation points. What if I put that in? That doesn't take me anywhere. Hmm, interesting. Tame, maybe? Tame isn't one. Uh, oh yeah, um, Reginaldo. It says, where is my sunshine? You are my sunshine. That's the name of the song. Okay, where is my sunshine? Okay, so we also have the names of the different friends, the different besties. Gertrude's was one of them. Wouldn't she? Gertrude's, how do you spell that? Whoa, okay, so that leads us to the 404 page again. But it says you killed her underscore why. I don't know, can I put this in? I can't search for that. The other friend was Clarice. That says you killed her Y again. Is that talking about in game or is there something like super meta happening with that? Okay, Jubilu, Jubilo, Jubilo. You killed him, Y. And then I have a feeling the last one is gonna be the same. Yeah, you killed him, Y. Do I need to answer the question to that? Okay, so that was the four friends. Is there anything else? Garotron? What if I search Megasoft? Nothing in Megasoft. What about Joe Garoto? No. Gato, maybe? Hmm, so Gato comes back with system error again. So that was Gato. Ugh, what other words are there? Can I search Alien? <laughs> Can I search me? Oh, if I search me, it says didn't think twice with the underscores. Dream. Oh, okay. So when you do dream, it gives us the system unstable again with a 404 message. I'm literally just like putting in as many words as I can possibly think of documents. Mm, what about sunshine? It downloaded a file. It says, once upon a time there was an old friend, wasn't special, nor was he any hard to befriend. He was captivating and much polite. From a distant land where I live, he has shed me a light. A dreamer he was, enclosed on his tiny little planet still. Lone he has been long, and was I waiting for someone until. He weeped and weeped, but I wiped his tears, for I longed for a friend as much as him all these years. He made me company. Finally, I found joy in life. Captivate me, I said, and he gave me a high five. Time has passed. The day's gone by, but my friend is gone, and I wonder why. Why, why, why? Why did you take my sunshine away? And that's a lot of sunshines. Is there anything else around here? So it sounds like from this, a dreamer, he was enclosed on his tiny planets still. So, wait... It sounds like to me that 
like these children, they want to be friends with Ben Fate or not Ben Fato, sorry, uh, Reginaldo. They go to his planet. He says, captivate me. And then he gave me a high five. And then time has passed. The day's gone by. My friend is gone. So he just abandons them. Why did you take my sunshine away? But this also sounds like Reginaldo and his besties. And he's like, time is gone. Huh, this is weird. I'm researching like crazy to try and figure out. Also, Amigo is another one that I can try and do. I'm, I'm so this text is called uh, Polybius, right? Which I'm like, how does this relate? Because I don't remember reading anything about Polybius. Polybius was a ancient Greek historian, but I don't think that's the connection. I think the connection is in terms of game context. Uh, it was an, apparently an urban legend about a supposedly cursed arcade game from the 1980s said to have caused amnesia, insomnia, nightmares, and other adverse psychological effects on its players, which is exactly what's happening here. According to the legend, the game appeared in a few arcades in Portland, Oregon, and was removed after causing these effects, leading to various conspiracy theories about its origin and purpose, including speculations about government experiments on mind control. However, there is no credible evidence that such a game ever existed, and the story is generally considered a modern digital myth. I'm assuming that this this is the this is probably like the direct inspiration would be my guess okay another thing i can try and put in is jorge cardosa which is mentioned here takes us to another page subject not prompt for initiation yet subject not prompt for initiation that feels so it feels so much like a cult doesn't it okay so in this last uh text in the crimes text it talks about retrograde amnesia the next thing i want to try is putting in because they asked me if i remembered it what if i say i don't remember it says lies and it this text leads me to the my sunshine HTML again. So what if I say I remember this time? Oh! This is wood chopping. Okay, what blank does he left best? What friend? Person? Sunshine? Task? Hmm, this might take some thinking. Maybe games? What games does he like best? Oh, I guess Bem Fato is a game. In a game. So it makes sense. Okay, so it's games. Uh, Remembrance Project? Trying to get me to remember some things? <gasps> oh god. Sensitive data unit profile, you know who? I don't actually. What? Sight, uh, sit, rep. Stop. 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 The experiment was subjected to the trials. Uh, they are observed. Stop it. Stop. I'm reading. Stop. I'm reading. It says you are not awake yet. Will you play with me? Just give me a second. The experiment was subjected to the trials. They are observed to be yielding, intelligent, curious, and willing to proceed with the program. They fit the profile accordingly. Oh, the unit profile is me? It's me. And up there it says confidential sender. Collected apples? Uh, mowed the lawn, went fishing, did not back down and managed to eliminate the noise. Noise known alias Gato. Uh, we're exposed to sensitive data provided by Megasoft. Despite being skeptical, are already showing clear signs of confusion. Yeah. I have, yeah. <laughs> they don't seem to acknowledge we're talking about them. Hi, do you know this is a game still? Yes. Can I put in yes? Oh, it doesn't let me type. Poor thing, you are not awake yet. Would you play with me? Proceed with tests. Have you been chased by foxes in your dreams? No. Proceed with the tests. Wait, cancel. No. Okay, it doesn't let me type in here. I might have to reload the page. It says down here, proceed with the test. Have you been chased by foxes in your dreams? I got a blocked pop-up. What is this? Oh, it says, can you sing along? Okay, this is singalong.html. Sunshine, my only sunshine, you make me happy when skies are gray. You are my son. you never noticed how much I love you. Oh, 
please. Oh, take my sunshine away. It says he knows. He knows what? Are you going to scare me again? He knows? What? You just downloaded something, didn't you? Oh, it did my sunshine again. Okay, I reloaded the page. They don't seem to acknowledge we're talking about them. I just want to see if I can actually put something in here. Unit profile, you know who. Yeah, I guess I do. Uh, do you think this is a game still? Yes. 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 Yes! Proceed with the tests? Ah! Why won't you let me- Okay, I think I have exhausted about as much as I can in terms of secrets from this game. I still, it seems to me, like from what I found, that I have found everything in the game, I think. Unless there's more sort of ARG content. If you enjoyed this, as always, be sure to leave a like down in the video. I think at the very end here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna delete this file. All right. There's even, there's even stuff here. Mayday, Mayday, Boratron system malfunctioning. There's even stuff in here that I think is really interesting. Um, I really liked this game. I did. I feel like, I feel like I personally, like having a more concrete ending to know that it's the ending. I know I got all the achievements and I even found the secret page and everything. But it still feels to me like there's a whole maze there. The labyrinth is the one thing that I'm just kind of unsatisfied with. And I'm like, is there a way to actually do that? Because I know you just have to delete the save file to get back in. But then once you get back in, you can't access the labyrinth anymore. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, be sure to leave a like down below and let me know in the comments. Um, if you'd like to play it for yourself, as always, the games are in the description of my videos. But I think on that note, I'm going to say farewell, friends. Thank you so much for being here. Remember, we're not alone out there. And I will see you guys in another video. Bye-bye. I sure hope one day playing all of these cursed video games doesn't eventually catch up with me.